Hey, this is John Lyons. I'm here to give you five quick tips that are going to help you sell your home. So tip number one is you definitely want to educate yourself on the market before listing the property. I know that sounds basic and elementary, but you want to make sure you know, is it a buyer's or seller's market? And what's the inventory levels? Uh, what's median sales price going for your area? What's the market time? And then of course, what are the comparable selling for within a half mile radius of your home? All this information is really going to give you a good appreciation of what to expect when you list the property, how to price the home, and then of course when offers do come in on how to respond to them on fact rather than on emotion. Tip number two, and I can't stress this enough, but you definitely want to prepare the property before going on the market. What do I mean? Declutter, depersonalize. Uh, if you've got an obscure color on the wall, you want to paint it a neutral color. Look guys, uh, buyers can't visualize themselves in your home if you've got a lot of stuff on the walls or if there's a lot of furniture in the home. So you want to thin things down. I know it's uncomfortable and difficult, but the bottom line is uh, this is a home that you're selling, not a home that you would typically live in. Uh, and then once again, it's going to give you more of a return on your investment. If there is any problems with the homes additionally, you want to make sure that you fix them beforehand, like a broken window seal or a leaky roof spot in the ceiling, furnace is acting up. Fix them all before you go in the market Buyers are going to see them, it's going to be a red flag, and it's going to lessen the chance of an offer. Um, and if it is, it's probably not going to be the best offer. Tip number three, it is incredibly important to get outstanding photography. Buyers shop online, end of story. They look online, they're going to like the photos, the staging, they're going to come see the home in person, and they're going to go back home, look at the photos, send it to their family and friends, and make a vote for or against your home. So make sure the, photo, the photos are outstanding. Tip number four is going to be make sure it's easy to show. Um, the more people that you get through the home, the more probability of getting an offer or offers, and it's not uncommon in this day and age, which is going to drive the price up. Always a good thing. And then lastly, number five, hire a pro. Hire somebody that's going to, that does this day in and day out, that can educate you on the market, that can guide you through the process of preparing the home, the photos, and then negotiating the best uh, price for the home. Uh, where can you find them? Friends, family, referrals. Zillow's got a great resource on finding a pro. I'd look at the reviews online and then I would, when I interview them, I would search uh, 123 Main Street on their listings, whatever the, the listing addresses are, and see how they're advertised. How many pages come up? Are they on YouTube? Are they on Facebook? Do they advertise on social media? All these things are going to give a better, better philosophy of what the agent does for marketing and then it's also going to get more eyeballs on you with that proper agent. So I hope this helps. If you like this, please press like, share it with a friend. I've got some links below that are going to help you out as well. Um, thanks again.